It is the BMW M6 GT3 from New New Models, and it is today's What's in the Box. Hey guys, welcome to another What is in the Box, and today we are taking a look at the BMW M6 GT3 kit from New New Models. Now this is going to do the 2017 Zurich 24 hour race for Team Falcon. Now this is going to be a modified reissue as we call it. So we're not going to do a full what's in the box look. If you're interested in that, I'll post a link somewhere in this video or at the end of the video. Who knows where I'll post it if I ever remember to once I get in the post. And you can take a look at that video. Today we're just going to focus on the new bits for this kit. Now this is basically the difference between this one and the first issue is going to be those fender vents that you see there. Which means this is going to be able to let us build for some of the 24 hour races, some of the races that require the fender vents, N uh, namely off the top of my head obviously the Zurich race and as well as the 24 hours of the Nürburgring which is awesome. I've been waking, looking, waiting for this kit so I can do the uh, PlayStation library that ran at uh, Nürburgring a couple years ago, the 24 hour race. I think it was last year, year before, one of those. But that's what I'm going to be doing with my version of this kit is doing the PlayStation library. So let's get into it and let's see what's in the box. So now we have the body, take a look at the body, and as you can see, they didn't touch the body at all. It is going to be exactly the same as in the first run. So what, what they did is they made the fender vents a separate piece. Or separate pieces mean you're going to have to attach them yourself, which makes sense. It was probably a lot cheaper to do fender vents than it was to retool the body and do a whole new body. So, you, so we're just going to be attaching the fender vents to the body to the, over the fenders so that's it that is basically the biggest change in this kit is going to be those fender vents now we'll take a look at the decal sheet and as you see it's made up done up in two separate sheets we'll focus on the big one we'll take a look at the big one first there you can see so now you're going to have to you'll have to match the blue the decals with the blue paint to get everything matched up, but at least you don't have to worry about trying to do all that um, separation there. Over here on the left, the uh, window trim decals. Now, if you don't want to use those window trims, you're in luck. Uh, Decal Docs has made a window masking set for the BMW M6 kits. Now, I've had a, I've had a set ordered from Hobby Link Japan since about February. I still haven't. Uh, fulfilled that order yet. I don't think they're ever going to at this point, but Smot, uh, Spot Model does have them in stock. That's the one place off the top of my head that I know that has them. It's like five It's like five euros for the uh, de for the window masking set. Just keep that option in mind if you don't want to use these and try to do it um, yourself. So that is that decal sheet, and we'll take a look at the rest of this. this one. So as you can see there. You have some choices of three different races and whatnot. I believe you can use the row stuff on the first version of the Team Row kit. Don't quote me on that. Please, I'm, GT racing is not my strong suit. My knowledge base is very minimal. I still, love the, I still love GT racing. I just don't know a lot about it and the teams and the different races and kind of gets confusing. But there you have your three choices there. That is that. And also, if you want to have a complete kit, you're going to have to buy the detail up set. This one does have um, correct color carbon fiber decals this time. In the first version they ran, the carbon fiber decals were more gray. These are more black. I haven't even opened this up yet. It actually just literally got delivered 20 minutes ago, uh, just before I started having lunch. I haven't even had a chance to actually open this up and look. But there is a detail up part set. You'll need this because some things are not included in the kit. The Conrads, I believe, obviously some of the carbon fiber decals and stuff. So you will need this if you want to have a full complete kit. I think that is going to wrap it up for this, what's in the box for this, for the BMW M6 GT3 kit from the new models for the Falcon 24 hour of Zurich race. There's plenty of uh, aftermarket decals for this kit if you don't want to build the Falcon livery uh, version. So on that note, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.